my friends, police department, uh, you can see that the first time King Groot and Super User were installed on my Android by me unsuccessfully as I was not allowed to use them. As soon as I would install one, you were able to see the only thing they did was they blocked me from installing it uh, and once the Super User, I guess, somehow would be installed on April the 20 and most likely at a later stage. I don't remember exact date. This is just a few days ago, uh, not even a week ago. The only thing they would do is they would drain me a battery. And plus that I am not allowed to use that. I have recorded and it's proven beyond any doubt that I was not allowed to use either King Root, Super User, anything that would allow me to modify so-called system files, which by the way are completely modified. They were completely modified already from the beginning. When I got this Android, they did this thing, they did this thing to me, they played with it. And in this video you can again see how the battery drains itself completely out. They drain the battery out. Uh, I think what they do is they spur a lot of uh, programs or something like this. I have no idea exactly what is it they do. Uh, but they have a capacity to destroy, again, through the charging issues uh, tablet. This tablet is not worth anything because this tablet is a gadget that has a Bluetooth on without your knowing even that one is on as you walk on the street, whatever it is that you do with it. Uh, second person, third party can do basically anything they want to do with it. It's a disaster with one word. That much for this video and you are also about to see that King Root and Super User now, you cannot even see them listed under uh, system applications. So you cannot see them anywhere at all unless you disable certain things. Then what happens is they pop up and you can actually see them, they exist inside the system. Uh, but there is regard Super User, there is regard uh, King Root programs used to uninstall the system files. This thing, whatever they have done to it, is much worse than King Root and whatever they did. They have much worse stuff they have installed themselves uh, on this thing. That's why this thing has got to go to uh, to the police station so they can see yeah, all this stuff they have done to it, right?
Oh, you can see again uh, attack the battery is depleting look at this 13% look at that you were seeing it was at 43% look at that 13% 12% I just wanted to see how how battery is depleted like this they can kill the telephone like this pretty fast <clears throat> you know unless you know really what you are doing so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna shut this thing off fast now and power one on a spear charger uh, then I'm gonna stop some applications and stuff like this then what I'm gonna do is I will go ahead and <clears throat> I'm gonna power one back but you can see what's happening you can see it with your eyes they try to kill the battery again the same thing like they have done before uh, this time actually thank you I, I got it even more and now it stopped look at that we, we stopped at 10 percent now that's interesting we stopped at 10 percent as soon as i start talking about it yeah and i am inside of the room this is the funniest room mm, just as the other one was it's a really funny room something i need to talk about more i have not uh, but you were able to see how the battery is depleted within like from 43% to 10% within like maybe two minutes or something like this. You were able to see with your own eyes this. This is a good stuff, definitely is a good stuff. because there's nothing you can do
I have no idea what the fuck you do with this. Huh? What do you do with this shit? Funny stuff, they are all running, but none is working really. I don't get it. How can they all operate, but none is working? Let's also pay attention to the fact that what I downloaded does not appear appears here anywhere. That's pretty crazy. Uh, it's now listed under the system and I don't have the access to remove that thing. I am specifically referring to these two processes right here. Oh, I'm sure this is working again. No, it's not necessary. It's Wi-Fi that is working. It's one or the other. And both. You're not going to find on a download. It's... It's kind of a weird because I cannot even see it here. This is really interesting. I cannot see it here. But I got to record this stuff. How this thing has been done, how these things are done, I do not know. But it's definitely something to take a note of it. It does not even appear here. And what exactly do I have in my mind is this thing here. You can see it right here, it's called a super user and there is also King Groot which it shows up at times and at times it doesn't even show up but you can see it, super user exists in fact where is it? I do not know where it is not a super user, not um, King Groot those are the two applications that are used to root the device. You cannot see them anywhere. They exist, but where do they exist?
Okay, so you can see right here keychain, you don't see the key root, and when it comes to the super user, the same thing. System update, system UI, and that's it. Speed test, sound recorder, smart card service, SIM tool, shell, setup wizard. Search application, uh, but you're not going to see anything super user. So it's they have done something that you cannot even see within the system itself. It's done like that. So, pretty screwed up, the whole thing. And uh, it's like this. Let me see, that was 4, 3, yeah, I better stop, 2, there you go, it's collapsing again, I gotta stop and turn it off. <laughs> um, I was completely correct a few minutes ago when I recorded this video, uh, absolutely, absolutely uh, correct. They're using something because I did disable a lot of applications right now. I don't know what is it they're using. Again, if you look at this thing here, it's not going to pop up anywhere. Look, that's all it comes to. It doesn't show the super user or king root or anything like this. But look, look what happens if you go to, let's say, what is running. Actually, sorry. If you go here to all. Um, sorry, 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 disabled. Disabled supposedly is a king root and super user. <laughs> I don't know how you can disable one if you don't actually even see one inside of it. Not even the system indicates one. Okay, but supposedly the super user and king root, which in no way I possibly can uninstall, uh, supposedly they are disabled. Where they are, uh, I have no idea because you cannot see them anywhere. Like, they don't even exist. It's like a ghost applications within the system that you cannot uninstall. There is nothing you can do. Look at that. You cannot find them anywhere. So, I was totally correct. They exist. They exist. And the way you disable them is but basically you disable... Um, the way you disable them, you disable basically this here. I'm going to show you what most likely got them. Uh, let me just go over and prove that you cannot you cannot detect this application like they don't exist but they do exist and the way you disable them is by going right here to smart card service and you when you pop that one to stop and then basically they show up otherwise you don't even know they exist are they disabled? I am very very skeptical about it I am skeptical about the whole thing because oftentimes let me go again actually most of the time you're not going to even see let's say bluetooth that is running you're not going to even see the bluetooth uh, let's say that is running but it's running you get this bluetooth share you see this bluetooth share version 5.1 do you see when it's running? No, you don't see it. You don't see it anywhere. So what's running supposedly is this thing here. This is what's running. So you don't have no idea really what's running on this thing and what is not running. And I assume that the battery gets depleted by these people having the ability to use this king root and super user. But it was already something before the king root and before the super user. Uh, they have used because I have just tried to install this about a week ago and I couldn't I couldn't install one but they seems like they did sure use the credentials uh, to bit this Android down it's not that most likely they couldn't do this already before uh, but they try to demonstrate they try to depict like now when you install this thing now we can do this stuff 
before we were like before we weren't capable to. I don't think so. I think this is totally controlled. I think they were able to do this all along. Um, already the gentleman over there in Zgirsh, the IT professional he is, uh, he already identified that uh, it's not even original. You cannot program this thing. It's, it's, I don't know what was done to it. That was his opinion that this is just, uh, you can hear it's, it's not the original system. Everything is modified inside and so on. So this was way before I have installed, I have dared to install <laughs> this um, rooting option on this device. Okay, so nothing you can really do about this. Nothing you can do about it. So that's a good stuff. Yeah, if I go back, it ain't going to make a lot of sense because this thing keeps coming back, but okay. All right, that's all I want to say. It pertains to the previous video. Regarding my uh, Belarus roommate, Yuri, this, isn't, this thing has been evident already from beginning here. Uh, but with him, Oh, actually, I couldn't go really wrong with it. You work on a tablet, let's say, and they crash all your browsers, except for one browser, let's say, okay? You have a difficulty upload stuff to the YouTube, to anywhere where you really want to do, because it says there is not enough memory, okay? I understand that issue. If that actually is even a real issue, the browsers would all reload itself, reload itself. You're having a very big hard time you have. You waste a lot of time searching on how you're going to even upload the stuff to the internet. And when you find something like, uh, let's say, UC browser that does not reload the page or Maxton or something like this, what they do is they, they even that thing, they screw you up. They crash you everything. Google, CM browser, Firefox, Opera browsers, nothing you can use to upload the stuff. The best part about it, you have a roommate that is all the time doing like, either like is, first it was with a Hassan who told me after uh, we were together like seven months, he came out uh, that you know, it wasn't sneezing like, like when you sneeze like this, let's say if you have a problem with the sneezing, something like this. But this would be like, like you're crying basically. And they had a specific scenario for that stuff, crazy stuff. I don't want to get into it yet. Then I got two. Then I got the Belarus guy uh, who was also with me in Denmark, came inside of the room yet again, another guy. And he started to do the same thing. Now the Hassan told me after seven months that this was due to injury. There was a bomb in Chechnya that exploded and gave him a problem. They had to do the surgery and he knows and stuff like that. Now, I can understand that. What I cannot understand is that you tell me this like after seven months doing stuff like this. That would be one thing. Regarding the Belarus guy, he's doing, he's doing some other stuff though. He go... <coughs> stuff like this and in addition to that was translated to me like that I should listen like a signs of what is uh, good for me to do and what is not good for me to do and then what he did was he did a dance in the room like this he would go uh, like this and you would have the browsers crash the programs crash um, Pen drive would be deleted on his stuff like this. This is a crazy shit. Crazy shit. You can't tell me there are no cameras inside in there. Uh, I'm not going to go into only they can hear the stuff, but it's got to be some way somehow that these people can see the guy giving them a sign when they're supposed to. I should rather say he is being told when what he should do by someone so he does whatever he does and he's told this by someone who is watching the stuff i do on tablet on what they tell him to move the hand or whatever and it's crashed and so it's like in front of you this kind of a song go basically on that is totally bizarre stuff uh 
I wouldn't even want to touch this kind of subject about the cameras. I'm the last person on earth who want to talk about this stuff. But this is just a factual. It's, it's, it's like some kind of joke or something like that.